This is a dangerous church. This is a dangerous church. This is a dangerous church. It's God's place to build the church. It's not my job, not your job. That's God's job. And Jesus said that here. He initiated the idea of the church. And in some translations at the end where it says, and all the powers of hell will not conquer it, say, and the gates of hell will not conquer it. Now, did you know hell is a gated community? <laughs> you ever thought about that? I wonder who's the head of the homeowners association. <laughs> Probably the devil, right? Gates are put up to keep people in and to keep people out. And Jesus said, the gates of hell won't prevail. In other words, you know what our job is? Storm the gates. Storm the gates. Why? Because there's people in there that need to know the truth. The Bible says, you remember, the truth will set you free. Free from what? The gates of hell. You can become a Christ follower. Dangerous churches forgive. That early church was a church of forgiveness. Oh, my goodness. And grace. It, they gave it out to everybody. They realize this, that everybody's blown it, screwed up, fouled up, messed up, and what we need is a second shot. It's not about where we've been or what we've done. It's about where we're headed. You see, the truth is when you're in a ditch, when I'm in a ditch, I don't need somebody to lecture me and tell me I'm there, right? I know it. I blew it. I'm wrong. I missed it. What I need is someone to bend down and reach down and give me a hand up Second idea there, dangerous churches are generous. Write that in. Let me tell you this about generosity. Generosity is the understanding that everything I have, skills, my life, my energy, my money, my stuff, comes from God, and I'm just a manager of it, so I'll share it with other people. We're going to take risks around here. We're going to miss. We'll do series that won't work. I'll get up and teach one week, and you'll even go, I could have had a V8. What if it doesn't work? Will we quit? No. We'll step back and try it again later. I mean, just because it didn't work the first time doesn't mean you stop. We're going to take these steps of faith and trust God big. And if we hit it, we're going to go, yes, God, thank you. And if we miss, we're going to laugh at ourselves and say, we'll try it again. Dangerous churches experience life change. In fact, that's why they exist. The currency of Church at the Bay is life day. Now listen, what's happening here at Church of the Bay is God's fault. There's no leader here taking credit for this. We're smarter than that. We're going to give God all the glory. Here's the deal, guys. If dressing up in a Barney suit and painting my face purple and calling me Pastor Barney <laughs> would mean thousands of people came to faith in Christ next year, I'm all in. I love you. You love me